Welcome. My name is Sophia. Sophia the Storytelling Fairy. Now, once upon a time, there lived a princess who lived in a castle. But, she was kidnapped by an enormous fire-breathing dragon. Many knights tried to take down the dragon, but none could succeed. She waits patiently, hoping for one knight, aka what we call a crewmate, comes to her rescue. Now, let us begin our wonderful story. Hey! How come I have to be damsel in distress? Ugh, why can't I be the cool knight that saves you from the dragon? Because it's my story, and that's the way I wrote it. You liked it, didn't you, Kishan? Eh? To be honest, Cooper, I kinda don't like the story. What? I mean the story is still good. It just needs some original ideas of a fairy tale story. It's just like Sleeping Beauty. Right, thanks for the feedback I needed, Kishan. No problem, and... What are you? Okay, got it. He says you two are no longer on speaking terms. Okay, fine. Be a big baby about it. Hey, don't talk to my boyfriend like that, brother. He's autistic. I'm autistic too. But he is a big problem as a friend to me. Watch it, bub. And stop yelling at my girlfriend. Well, your girlfriend is my sister. Brothers trump boyfriends. Now. Nah. Yes, huh? Calm it down, Pofilwamu. I'm having fun in this Ipe Rocco Cronoedo. Speaking Greek is fun. Especially of what I call my Greek dance. What is he doing? Oh, he's just made a mod he recently installed, making him a jester. Interesting. Yeah, we're all getting into it. It decides everyone in a medieval Greek world with its own unique power to inspire Cooper's very own book story. Not like you enjoyed it. Look, I'm sorry Cooper and sister. Your story is great. But one thing that isn't great though, Phoenix's dance moves. Like who would be entertained by his moves? <laughs> again, again. Yes, your lordship. Whatever you desire. Do we have to speak in Greek words or accents? Can't we please just speak normal English and play normally? Okay, fine, I guess we won't have a fantasy game. You hear that, everyone? Kishan doesn't want you to have fun. But I'm really having a fun time getting to be a dragon. Yeah, I was really excited to be a spooky witch. And Poop Farts wants to be a peasant. Why would you want to be a peasant, Poopy Farts? You could be anyone in this fantasy story. Yeah, I'll let him know. He says you two are no longer on speaking terms. Oh my god, I hate this episode already. <laughs> I get the squire roll. Is that good? It's one of the worst rolls you get. Yeah, it gives you a shield ability to block any attacks. But its durability is very low. So you can only use the shield a few times. Great. What did you guys get? I am the knight. I can use my sword to vanquish evil. Basically I can defeat anyone at will. Yeah, and I am the king. With my mighty scepter, I can command anyone to do my bidding. It's so OP, dude. So OP. Is there anything else I need to be concerned about? Oh yeah, there's no reporting the bodies or calling emergency meetings. So basically there's no voting anybody out or imposters. It's a fantasy match of killed or be killed. Now stop asking questions. And dance. Oh come on. Y'all are about to get burned, bros. And I'm not talking about smoking cigarettes this time. Uh, uh. Run for it. Oh my god. Jake turn into a dragon? That is so OP. So OP. What are you guys doing here? Wait. Why are you guys standing next to Carol and Mariana's dead bodies? I can't explain. Let me tell you what happened. 
Early when the game had started, they both came here and saw Pukfart's body lying in which he was pretending. Both of them thought one of them was the culprit. Then, the two ladies got into a wizard duel battle, man it was so cool. But eventually, they both died in an explosion. Afterwards, it woke up Poop Farts who was actually was sleeping. Wow. That was very notable of you Poopy Farts. Okay I'll tell him. He says you two are still not on speaking terms. Ugh. I'm already having a worse time in this episode. Wait a minute, then how did you get here? I have the power to see players who are dead or not. That's why it brought me to here. Wait, can you check and see if that's okay? Okay, here we go. Oh my my. How hope someone could rescue me. Yeah, she's totally fine. For now. We have to go fight that dragon to save her. You want us to go fight that dragon out there? We are going to get slaughtered. It's okay. I can attract with my dance moves. No one can resist this Dan. Uh-oh. Uh Run, guys. Poopy farts. Oh, my heroes. You both came to rescue me. We sure did. I'll protect you guys with my shield. Crap. My shield. Don't worry Kishan. Thanks for buying me enough time to let me defeat the dragon. Uh, we did it Cooper. We defeated the dragon. Yes, but... Kishan. Are you fine with me and your sister a couple? I don't want you to feel upset. Of course I'm fine with it. Go have fun with her. Thanks! Now princess, are you ready? Yes my lovely boyfriend knight. And so, they defeated the dragon. And the trio lived happily ever after. The end.